All right, guys, it's uh, pool day here at the Greenhorn Barbecue Beer, and today we're going to pull out this little 14-inch Smoky Joe by Weber. It's probably the tiniest little charcoal grill that they make, and we're going to cook up some party wings, guys. So let's get started. Now, the first thing you're going to see about this is obviously it's small, guys. Like I said, it's only 14 inches across. That thing makes it pretty tiny. It's got a little grate. Yeah, as you can see, we haven't even used this yet. We got this for a bargain, let's just say. And uh, we're gonna be doing some cherry wood chunks, guys. All right, since we are doing the party wings, we love to use the cherry on that chicken. It even rhymes, but it produces some beautiful flavor and a cool color, almost a mahogany color. So let's get started on seasoning up those wings. All right, guys, uh, today we're gonna be using, of course, some Uncle Steve's Shake, the spicier. We really like this stuff. Not only for the color, but obviously the spice got a little bit of heat. It's great on chicken, guys. That's all we're gonna use. Now I'm gonna glove up with some of these 5.5 mil nitrile gloves from the Clean Space Project, guys. Uh, go check them out. They're uh, pretty nice gloves. And I'll also leave a link to this stuff in the description. So nothing really to write home about here, guys. These are your typical party wings. Um, they are still somewhat frozen. I wouldn't say frozen other than just really cold. You know, we've let them thaw out overnight. Um, and my goal here is to get as much smoke delivery to these as possible. Now, how do you think we're gonna do that, of course? Well, I already mentioned we're gonna be using this cherry wood, which is fantastic. And uh, I'm gonna show you here how we are going to smoke these up on that little Weber, that little 14 inch. Okay, look at that color. Is that beautiful or what, guys? Plenty of flavor, guys. Anything that might come off, that's okay. All right. All right, guys, so here we go. Now, as you know, it's got a 14 inch grate. Pretty nice. Now, what I've done here is in order to set up all the party wings all around the perimeter, I've taken one of these small little aluminum pans and I've cut out the bottom. Then I flipped it upside down. I put a little tumbleweed in the middle and that's what I'm gonna light up right here. All right, it's a little windy out here, but I think, I think we'll be all right. There we go. Gonna get that going nice, and then I'm just gonna put a couple briquettes in there because that's what I want to catch fire. Now this is Ridge charcoal. It's my preferred charcoal. And there we go. So the grate is probably closer to uh, yeah about 13, 13 and a quarter. So it's small, guys. But as you can see here, how we're gonna set up all them party wings all the way around here, guys should be pretty cool. Now I don't have my, a thermometer on the lid, so I'm going to be taking this Thermo Pro TP19 and every once in a while, you know, I'm going to poke it into the vent to just make sure that I'm getting a decent temperature. I'm not really going for any special temperature, guys. I know that it's going to get probably around 350, 300, 350. That's what I'm shooting for. here and I'm gonna put on the party wings. Look at these things. They are 
freaking fabulous. I couldn't be more happy how these turned out, guys. The color is beautiful. Uh, it took longer than I expected, but that's okay. Not a big deal, guys. Uh, oh, I'm gonna bite into one right now. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Fantastic, guys. I made sure the internal temperature got up to about 160. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. We're gonna go in, finish these off, and we'll see you on the next one. Cheers.